Jackson Chow. What's up, everybody? All right, we went from Bangkok to Pattaya today. It took me two hours. It's super easy. I didn't make a video on it. So I'm going to include this in the title. If you want to go from Bangkok to Pattaya, there's a bus service. You go to the Amaki bus terminal and you take the counter to the far right. You'll walk up to a square counter. There'll be like this, 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 like a box. There's a guy yelling on the right, Pattaya, ignore him. And on the inside to the right, like right here, is a blue stall. And that's the bus you want. It's 130 baht. Took two hours. Aircon wasn't the greatest uh, as far as bus traveling goes from my one experience now in Thailand to Vietnam. Vietnam wins 1-0. I don't know what the sleeper buses are and stuff like here. But what we do have is a phenomenal hotel room. The first one we were in was not that great. It was just a really good value and we were trying to maximize our money. So I didn't even film it and we were there for too long. I'll release the name of this one once I leave it. Uh, but as of now, we'll just leave it, leave it out. You got a king bed, you've got a full patio, you've got this little sleeper nozzle, little nook thing to relax. As you can see, all my equipment is out. Um, this is my laptop for editing. This is a wireless mouse. This does have a great mouse pad like a Mac on it, but uh, I still like a, a mouse for some precision. That is the stream watching phone. That is the streaming phone. So we're charging those both because we're about to start our first longer live streams here in Pattaya. This is my 130 watt charging brick. Can charge a lot of stuff at high speed quickly. This is the neck fan. Everybody asks. You don't have to go with any kind of model. Just type in neck fan, especially if you're getting it off Amazon America, and just find which one is within your price range and uh, what the reviews are on it. So then this is the rest of my camera gear. Again, this content will be on Patreon. This is the RS Twin. This is the SIM card and SD card holder. I took all the other country SIMs out because they're null and void now. This is my filming bag. So this is what I take, the gimbal, the streaming setup, everything in. I always take at least two cameras with me outside of my streaming setup. I've learned over the years that every time I leave a camera, you deeply regret it. So again, I'll include the name of the bus station for getting here. It's super easy in Bangkok. You can take the Metro or the BTS, whatever you want to take. This uh, particular hotel is great location. I don't know exactly. We'll find out a little bit more. seems to be two kilometers from everything, so that seems pretty good. It's got charging ports everywhere, USB charging ports. The really nice thing about this is they have all this. You'll kind of notice as you go around Thailand, it's more set up to live at the hotels because the Americans can stay here so long and a lot of other people, they can stay here longer than 30 days pretty easily. So they've accommodated the hotel rooms for that. There is a, uh, I don't think this is a two trunk one. No, it's not, but it's fine. You run the quick 15 minute wash. You don't even need soap and you're good to go if you're a real cheapy. You've got a nice microwave up here. Everything's clean in this place. It seems like a newer build as well. TV works great, all kinds of different channels. You've got a stovetop grill. Today there is no alcohol sales, but what do you know? You can, if you're resourceful. This would be for the late night when I'm editing and I'm up late and it's difficult to get stuff delivered. These, these are really good. They also have a really good like burger out of the bag. It's like a pork burger. So that's the late night snacks. I prepare for that stuff. So as far as the Thailand trip has been going, it's been going really well. I'm excited to check out Pattaya. I've got a couple of buddies here. They're down to show me down, show me around. So you'll see them on live stream. You'll see the return of Humphrey, uh, digital nomad, or what the hell is his channel? Man? Router gods, my bad. So you'll see him back up on some stuff. We got some time left in, in Thailand. We're going to do, I think Pattaya at least the next few days and maybe go back to Bangkok and end the trip there. We'll see how Pattaya content goes. So far, I'm really liking Thailand. Um, again, I'm reserving all the information for the verse videos. We're going to do a bunch. I'm going to talk about cannabis and how to use cannabis here safely so you don't freak out. What you should be paying for cannabis. I'm going to talk about the pros and cons of living in Saigon versus Bangkok. The cost of living for Saigon versus Bangkok is one better than the other. Are they two completely different things like I've always said? We'll really find out. Nice little patio. 
I don't smoke cigarettes, so I won't have any use for this patio, but it's nice that it's here. It's funny, after you quit smoking cigarettes, and if you don't smoke anything at all, maybe just a vape, your need for a patio drastically reduces in life. So, yeah, it's super easy to get here. You go to that one thing, you take one blue bus. You know, it was me and another tall guy. It wasn't the most enjoyable two hours. The air count was a bit shot in the uh, bus. It needed recharged two years ago. But these are things you can expect in all of traveling around this part of the world. India, Cambodia, Laos, Vietnam. These are all going to be very much like that. So... To get butt hurt about it doesn't make a whole bunch of sense. But I think it's a very, very nice uh, hotel room. I mean, you can't ask for a better hotel room for this price. Oh, I keep forgetting price, $32 a night. For 32 bucks a night, not bad. You know, full nice tub. It's relatively clean, not much mold. And you've even got a, a full-on toilet with a full-on proper bidet. Not just the bum gun. The bum gun's okay. The the drop-down bidet works much better. It lines up better with your uh, your body parts. And a clean hang shower, just like I like. This is, for me, ideally exactly what I'm looking for in a room when traveling around Southeast Asia. I want it to be in the $30 range. I want it to be clean. I want it to have a lot of outlets. I want the air con to work perfectly. I want a, a work area like I have over here. I want another bench where I can put my bags. Not just like the on-load bench like they have over here, but this is exactly what I'm looking for in a uh, hotel room when I go to rent for this type of stuff. So I'm excited to do Pattaya. Let me know what you want to see me do here. This video is going to drop tonight, so it would be keen to hear what all you guys want me to see. We could only be here for a day or two. It depends on you guys. It depends on the live streams. And depends on what you want me to go film. I have not been researching really anything. Um, you know, I had my wife with me the first week and we were just doing couple stuff, eating food, staying out of the heat, you know, hanging out in the bed, if you get, get what I'm saying. And just, you know, um, it, uh, loving each other type deal. So, yeah, I think this is a really nice hotel. I'm pretty stoked with it. New aircon, doesn't smell, there's no weird smell. I, granted, it's got no view, but I don't really care about a view. Like, what the hell do I need to look at a view for? I got a view. I got a view. You know wherever I go. So that is the hotel room. That is the trip to Pattaya. Super, super easy. Uh, some people, I think it only takes an hour and a half. I think maybe because I went in the afternoon, there was probably higher traffic of where, like, getting out of the initial city took a little longer than what it would naturally take. So yeah, I would definitely come check out Pattaya if you're in Bangkok. It's super cheap and easy to get here. What's a hundred baht, 130 baht, $5, I think, like $5 to get here. And you can definitely get a hotel room for a very, very good deal here. So come check her out, eh? So we'll be live streaming and I'll be filming all kinds of stuff. And then we are gonna go to Bangkok and I'm gonna go out and film stuff. So no more malls, I promise. We're all over the malls, all right guys? Thanks for watching. Stay frosty. If you want to take a private tour on Patreon and see all the additional content that's being shot in Thailand, 50% of the Thailand trips going up on the Patreon, you can sign up for as little as $5 a month. If you just want to hit and run and come check out just the Thailand stuff this month for 5 bucks, go ahead and do it. I don't care. So either way, smash the like button, subscribe, comment. Thank you all so much. See you on the next one. Stay frosty. Peace out.